Welcome back to Talk Southern to Me. I'm your host, Hallie Tarpley. Um, I'm from Alabama, and today I'm joined by Ryan Hurd. How are you doing? I am great. Thank you for having me in here today. Talk everything Southern. That's amazing. I live in Nashville, Tennessee. have for like 10 years. So. Yeah, and you're from Michigan. From Michigan, which is, you know, close to, it's not Southern. <laughs> Canada's South. Canadian. There you go. That, I've never heard it put that way. Welcome to my, like, weird house. <laughs> I um, love your dogwoods. They, your, oh. Ilex. Oh, the, those. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, they're yeah. gorgeous, aren't they? Yeah. Beautiful this season. It's really <laughs> flourished. Would you like some southern juice? Bring it. Okay. I'm a little nervous because I have no idea what it, what that is. Oh, you're pouring it. Would you like some? I would love some. This is so nice. I usually have to pour it myself, but this is just kick my feet back. Cheers. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, should we get started? Sure. Okay, you live in Nashville and you lived in Nashville for 10 years. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can, you have a really good perspective. You have a, a trans-regional Well, I, I mean, most people in Nashville are, are transplants, so. Everybody in Nashville is from somewhere else. So I feel like I'm pretty local. Okay, wow. That's beautiful. Okay, we'll start with a Googled question about the South. Cool. This one's touchy. Do Southerners talk slow? Uh, no. I feel, I feel like television has kind of made a lot of accents blend together. So um, I feel like if you are in Nashville, you it would not be surprising to find somebody who spoke with a very thick accent. But at the same time, it's very uh, you know urban, and it would not also surprise you to have somebody there who talks like me, which is pretty CNN. Try not to say like that hard A from Michigan, like calendar. I always get made fun of for saying the word calendar. Calendar? Yeah, because I'm from Kalamazoo, Michigan, and there's just that really hard Michigan A. You know what I'm talking about? Okay, do you say like Kalamazoo? Yeah, oh. some people do. Mm -hmm. I try not to now, but I hear it now, so. You, did you have to unteach, undo it? Um, the longer I've lived in Tennessee, the more my, like my my voice has changed, my accent has changed in a little bit. Where I don't speak in a southern accent, but I definitely speak more neutral. If that makes sense. Do you speak at a different pace, slower? Mm, not on purpose, but maybe I don't know. I've never thought about it. I'm getting a good like chill vibe. That's like a good the... that's a good representation of of Ryan. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. the Ryan Hurd effect. Yeah. Just pretty relaxed. Yeah. It's pretty early in the morning and. Uh, Love being here, so uh, yeah, just everything's cool. Okay, everything's cool. So subscribe, that's cool. <laughs> please do, please subscribe. Please, please. It, the, this was a two-parter, because the next one is why do Southerners talk slow? Okay. But I feel like you really sort of covered a... I feel like Southerners talk slow because they're never in a hurry. Yeah. And that's true. I'm never late for anything. And unless I'm late right now, it I was late. Matter. Don't you look? I was late the other day, <laughs> but but I feel like in the South that the the time thing is is it's, it's it's all approximate. That's a real thing. Okay, windows of time. Yeah, like around nine fifteen. Yeah. Like probably not though. Probably like nine twenty five, nine thirty. Nothing wrong with that. We might leave when we're supposed to be somewhere. That kind of thing. Right. Okay. Should we move on to a question about about you? Whatever. Okay. Why is Ryan Hurd married? Uh, it's a good question. I feel like it's pretty self-explanatory, though. Uh, well, there's two reasons. Uh, number one, I asked her to marry me, and then she said yes. I see. So I guess that's the simplest way to answer that question. But also, like, when you find somebody like Marin, you, you got to lock her down. So. Isn't that the truth? In like a very loving way, not in a controlling or it came across <laughs> <laughs> wrong. No one's ever asked me like why I got married. That's kind of a strange question. But people I are Googling it. I feel like more people would Google why is Marin Morris married? Mm. But once again, the simplest answer is she really wanted to get married to me, so uh, She wanted to lock you down. Lock Ryan down. Yep. Uh, how tall is Ryan Hurd? I'm six foot three. Um, my wife is five foot one, so there's quite a height difference, but it works, it fits. She's like, fits like right here in my like shoulder pocket, which oh. is, so it's cool. 
That's perfect. Exactly. Do you can you go like weeks without seeing her if you just don't? Oh. Could you just miss her? Kind that's. Of? No, that'd be really weird. But okay. I understand your concern. I'm Because yes, that is like a foot, like 14 inches, right? Yeah. So. The possibility is there, but I have yet to get to miss her for an entire week. Okay, good. That's you guys seem like you have a really healthy marriage, <laughs> so I'm really most days, most days, <laughs> like everybody else. Good. Okay. Um, oh, does Ryan heard smoke? No, I don't smoke. Jewel. No, no, I never got into that. Um, I, I drink too much on occasion, but I don't smoke. No, not my thing. Okay. The, the people were curious. I don't mind. I prefer bars that allow smoke. In Tennessee, they still allow smoking mm. in bars. I prefer to be in a smoky bar because it attracts the kind of people that I like. Right? right. That's cool to me. Yeah. So I don't mind that environment at all. I don't mind being around smoke, but no. Not a smoker. Not a smoker. Okay. That's great. Good, healthy, great. You can answer this from both sides. Okay. What do Southerners call Northerners, or what do Northerners call Southerners? You can I feel like Yankees and rednecks, right? That's like a pretty common like uh, misunderstanding that's going on. Those are the, uh, the first two words that came to mind. I don't mean them to be rude. No. I'm just answering the question. Hey. It's all right to be a redneck. I put you in a bad spot. Um, but no, that is, I think you're being very truthful. Okay. And that's all we can ask for here in this creepy house corner. Um, doing our best. <laughs> we're just doing our best. Um, what are you looking most forward to about becoming a father? I feel like we are prepared but not ready, if that makes sense. Like mm. we've got all the stuff, we've been to the hospital, I know where to park, you know? Sure, parking lot. Um, no, a very specific spot in the parking garage. Oh, it's a garage? Yes. I'm sorry, okay. Yes, and uh, so I feel like, you know, we have like the nursery set up, it's like the last part of our lives where it's just like two of us. Mm. So I'm excited to be like the three of us. That'll be a really fun thing. How is Marin gonna, is it gonna be weird that she's not the shortest in the house anymore, do you think? <laughs> yeah. Freak her out. Actually, that might be weird. You're missing her, she's missing the baby. Yeah. It's just like. That makes, that sounds terrible. <laughs> You've locked each other up in this house. If I can't see her, I'm definitely not seeing him. Right? right? So you make me sound like very absent and you make <laughs> it feel like, you make it sound like she's not gonna, you know, whatever. Any, have you gotten any good parenting advice? That yeah, um, guys and Lady Annabellum told me uh, onesies with zippers, not buttons. Oh my God. You don't wanna be up at 2 a.m. messing around with buttons, you just wanna zip it up. I think that's, we're almost out of time here. Okay. I talk to you all day though. I, I have nowhere to be. Should we? This is gonna be yeah. southern time. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just like a rolling rock through. Do you, what's going on with you? What's I coming what's what's coming down the pipe? I'm in the middle of my tour right now, platonic tour, mm -hmm. and uh, we're playing two nights in New York. Um, it's gonna be a really good year of music and a good year of changes personally for the two of us. And uh, that's the update. Cheers to a very successful year. Absolutely, thank yeah. you very much. Good luck Thanks with for the, having uh, me. The little one. This oh. is real. It is, yeah. I don't mess around. Mm -mm. Um, cheers. Cheers. Subscribe to Talk Southern to me. And follow me at Ryan Hurd on Twitter and Instagram. And Facebook if you feel like seeing stuff my team posts about me. <laughs>